Russell Fork Pharmacy is your locally owned pharmacy, offering fast, friendly service with competitive prices and free delivery. Call 606-754-7085. Visit RussellForkPharmacy.com and download our free mobile app for refill requests and more. Halloween is just around the corner, but events to celebrate the holiday are looking a little different this year. Many events had to cancel due to certain restrictions during this COVID-19 pandemic, but the Pike County Public Library adapted to the new so-called normal and held a drive through Witches Carnival. We knew Halloween was going to be different this year, and we wanted to find a way to still have something fun and festive and hand out candy, even though we are still closed for in-person programming. We threw around a lot of ideas trying to find something that would work outdoors and stay within the health department's guidelines and finally ended up with the Witch Carnival where we could work in games and candy and a photo booth. The carnival included inflatables and Halloween decorations with six spooky games looping around the library parking lot. Kids could throw beanbag ingredients into the witch's cauldron at the witch pitch, <laughs> test their memory at the witch's shuffle, hear a joke from the witch's will, play the spider ring toss, go fish in the witch's swamp, and test their nerf gun skills at the pumpkin patch. Once all games were completed, attendees were given a treat bag from the witch's broomstick <laughs> and could take a photo in a drive-up photo booth on their way out. The library contacted the Pike County Health Department regarding the carnival in its early planning stages to ensure safety and adherence to COVID guidelines. Children played games from the safety of their vehicle out of car windows. All employees wore masks and gloves and practiced social distancing. All candy and prizes were prepackaged and ongoing sanitation of games with limited contact took place. Olivia Eldridge, a parent who attended the carnival, said that she felt comfortable and safe during the event due to the extra cleaning steps the workers were taking after each car passed through. How, how much have the kids enjoyed it? Oh, they loved it. Yeah, they've had a ball. Yeah. If they had some more events like this, you would come back? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we go to all the events at the library. Yeah! Hi! Are you all having fun? The carnival was definitely a team effort. We had librarians from all of our branches across the county come and help out with it and prepare for it and put the work into it to make it a success. And we thank everybody who came out and who waited patiently in line for their turn at the games and for the, at the photo op. We appreciate everyone who helped make it a success. Reporting from Pikeville, Kentucky. Happy <laughs> I'm Jeremy Justice with Mountaintop News.